Hey, God bless you. This is Pastor Doug Taylor back with another Tuesday Truth. Just a couple of days ago, I had the incredible privilege of sharing with an amazing young man who has wonderful plans in store for him. And as he shared with me, uh, he said, my biggest challenge is, Pastor, I'm trying to change and change is just so hard. And what I shared with him is, I said, uh, listen, change is hard when you make it hard because change is going to happen whether you want it to or not. And because God works in us to, to change us and situations change and life changes, many times the real struggle is not struggling to change. Most times we're really struggling not to change because change is uncomfortable, change is new, and uh, we are wired somehow to criticize or kill things that we don't understand. So unfortunately, many times we can short circuit our own future because we, we, we fight against the change that's desired to bring growth. One great phrase I hear all the time is, all change does not bring growth, but all growth demands some changes. So I believe the changes that you and I are, are experiencing right now are intended to, if we use them properly, to cause us to grow in several areas, uh, maybe emotionally, financially, physically, spiritually. But if we can embrace change, I believe we can grow. Three simple points I want to share with you concerning growing and, uh, and, and, and changing. Number one, I said just I said a second ago, change has to be embraced. Don't fight change because change is going to happen whether you want it to or not. Embrace the changes in life and you can grow uh, and accommodate every stage of life. Number two, uh, change has to be endured. Change does not happen instantly. It happens in increments. It took years for you to become the person that you are today, and it may take years or months or, so, uh, or, or days to become the person that you're going to be, but embrace the changes and endure it because at the end, if you ride it right, you're going to come out on top. And number three, change requires, uh, re requires new environments. You and I are going to have to make the choice one day, listen, I don't want to continue to be the big fish in the little pond. If I got to be the tadpole in the ocean, I'll do that because I'm going to grow to the tank that I set myself in. You and I embrace change, endure change, and set, in, set environments for change. We're going to be happy at who we become. Because again, I say it again, all change doesn't bring growth, but all growth demands change. So let's change. Let's grow. Let's do better. Let's be, let's, let's be bigger. Let's enjoy life at a whole other level. Hey, God bless you. This is Pastor Doug Taylor. Thank you for uh, watching with Tuesday Truth. If it's blessing your life, let's share it. Post it uh, for the email. Let's make a movement to change the lives of men. God bless you. See you next week. Bye-bye.